New developments tonight. Pasco County officials closing a road now after more holes open up in that neighborhood in Hudson. As we take you through the timeline now of how this neighborhood got to this point on Monday, you know, ABC Action News was out there, started pressing the county for answers after worried homeowners reached out to us. The county confirming that a total of 16 depressions happened on that day. And then 24 hours later on Tuesday, the number suddenly grew to 16 holes. Our crews out there pointing out this hole that opened up in that area and a road that's called Willow Brook Court. And that is the road that crews shut down tonight. And then on Wednesday, scientists from USF were sent to that area to map out the surface to learn more about how this happened. And that brings us to today. Not only a road closed to the Lakeside Woodlands community, but there are now suddenly 36 depressions. Nicole Grigg has been out there working for answers since this all started, and she joins us now tonight with the very latest. Nicole? Paul, well, you can see the road behind me is closed. The county tells me that's because there is a void underneath this road. It's 17 feet across, so that would be basically to here almost across the entire roadway. This is video I shot two days ago. This line right here in this hole opening back up. The county now saying a geologist found there's a 17 foot void under the road here, so they're now shutting it down because of public safety. They're still waiting to find out how deep it is. We have school buses that go through here. We have garbage trucks, cement mixers, dump trucks, and all that excess weight is just putting pressure on it. The county says these depressions are active, growing and unstable. I fell in just standing on the ground by itself. The HOA president yesterday, I was having a conversation with him walking and I turn, he's gone, he fell in. Pat Johnson lives just a few houses down. She saw that hole by the road growing too. It is, and I've been, I watched it open and back up and they had filled it up, what, that day before? Right. Yeah. Pat says after days of no answers on the growing depressions from the county, communication is much better. You came, you made phone calls, you got it started. I know you did and I say, Nicole, thank you very much. And a lot of worry out here still tonight. Now the county tells me that these are not catastrophic sinkholes that swallow everything in a second. They say that they're waiting for a geologist's final report to figure out exactly what's going on here. Reporting live in Hudson, Nicole Gregg, ABC Action News. Nicole, thank you. And next here.